Hello everyone and welcome back to Asian Noob. Since I covered fresh foodstuffs yesterday, I wanted to quickly go over the new technology that replaced it in the House of Wisdom and that's the Fertile Crescent. On paper, this technology looks really good, but I still wanted to crunch the numbers and confirm our assumptions. Let's dive right in. As usual, let's cover the basics first. The Fertile Crescent can be researched at the House of Wisdom in the Feudal Age if you choose the economic wing. It only takes 30 seconds to research and costs a measly 25 food and 75 gold. I thought it was a typo when I first read it, but it provides a 25% discount to all economic buildings and houses. Farm is technically considered an economic building, so yes, this discount applies to them as well. In fact, this 25% discount applies to houses, mills, lumber camps, mining camps, farms, docks, markets, and town centers alike. Just reading this statement alone screams the tech is worth it, but here's the payback calculation regardless for those who are wondering. You'll need to build 8 each of either houses, mills, lumber or mining camps, 6 of farms or docks, 4 markets, or just one town center. So yeah, even if you ignore every other discount you may get from other buildings, simply building one additional town center already pays back the investment by almost twofold. Also, one additional important note here is that the Fertile Crescent discount bonus stacks for the docks. So Abbasid players can actually build docks for only 56 wood each, which is insane. Hence, there's nothing to overcomplicate here. Since the opportunity cost is also very low due to the cheap cost of the tech, the Fertile Crescent is indeed an absolute no-brainer and should be picked up as soon as possible. It could very well be one of the strongest ecotechs in the entire game for its cost right now, and I wouldn't be surprised if it receives a rework in the future, just like how the devs did with Fresh Foodstuffs. Well, that's all you need to know about the new Fertile Crescent technology for the Abbasid Dynasty in Age of Empires 4. Deducing its worthiness was so simple that there was no point in beating around the bush and making the video any longer. It's just too good and should be prioritized. I'm also working on covering more of the Season 4 changes, so be sure to like and subscribe to not miss out. As always, thanks for watching everyone. I hope you and yours stay happy and healthy, and see you all in the next one.